So. Yeah, I mean, that's the thing, like, there's definitely cool stuff about Tekken 7. I think Miguel looks sick. I think it looks really cool, but... I just will, I just know myself, and I just will not be able to get over these guest characters. Start ramming them in. It's just gonna, like, ruin it for me. It'll ruin it, because it's not like... It's not the case where you can just say, oh, well, I won't play them. It's like anybody else can play them. And then, you know, if you're in rank coming across all these freaking guest characters, it's just gonna be like, I want to play Tekken against Tekken characters. I don't want guest characters coming in, you know? I don't want to have that going on. Um, if I'm buying Tekken, it's because I want to play Tekken. Not, you know, Street Fighter characters and Soul Calibur, whatever they're gonna do. I don't know what they're gonna do, but... I mean, they've clearly said now that the extra characters that are coming in like the season pass or the DLC, whatever it is, it's not gonna be Tekken characters, it's gonna be, you know, crossover characters. And that's just so much bullshit to me. I don't want it at all. So, you know, listen to like how angry I'm getting right now. Like, it really makes me angry. So I know that playing it is gonna be like, no good, no good. The only way it would be manageable is if there was some sort of like block button, so you could block out all the guest characters and just have proper Tekken characters. But that won't be the case. Damn, Jahuzi is on a streak, huh? I'm gonna stop this bitch, this son of a bitch. Asshole. <laughs> Fucking asshole. <clears throat> Dealing with all the new characters is going to be annoying in the beginning. It's not even the beginning, Mihawk. Like, it's just, it's the case of, like... I think what you're saying is, like, learning the matchups. That's not what it's about for me. It's about... Like I say, I want to play a Tekken game with Tekken characters. I don't want all this guest characters thing. Even if I do, like, learn how to fight them and, like, learn the matchup or whatever it is. That's not what I'm worried about. I'm just like, it's just going to be so annoying for me to constantly running into, you know, Akumas, definitely, or whatever else characters, Ryus, or whatever they put in, whoever they put in. I just have no idea who they're going to put in. Because, <clears throat> I mean, the thing about it is, in that stream they did, they were like, oh, hey, guys, why don't we talk about, like, what other guest characters would you like to see? Not even from other fighting games. Just widen it out. Maybe it's from anime, maybe it's from whatever. Maybe not even fighting games, maybe just video games in general. Would you like to see Lara Croft from Tomb Raider in Tekken? I mean, obviously that's not who it's gonna be. They're not gonna have Lara Croft in there, but... <clears throat> the way they were talking about it was as if they could just take characters from anywhere. From any, like, genre, whether it's an RPG or a freaking Call of Duty thing or whatever it is. And that's just horrifying to me. It's absolutely horrifying. I don't want that. That's bullshit. And I don't want it. <clears throat> and that was in the official Tekken stream, so... You know, that's not even like some crazy guy. It's just the official thing. <clears throat> Yeah, the lobby is full in, all right, Mihawk? You're our only hope, Mihawk. Spamming Akuma. Yeah, I mean, Juruga... Yeah, I think you guys are misunderstanding me a little bit. Like, it's not about how cheap they are. Like, I think Akuma is a little bit cheap. I recently saw a video on YouTube, I think this morning, 
I got an email about Akuma having like a 90% combo <clears throat> in the newest version of the game. Um, you know, which is, uh, you know, that is a result of him having a completely different gameplay system. Akuma does not work like a Tekken character. He works like a Street Fighter character that has been rammed into Tekken. Like, he doesn't fit, and that's the reason why his combos, I mean, people say that you can do the same combos in Tekken 7 as you've done in Street Fighter, which to me is not the way it should be. It should be that he has all new combos for Tekken, you know, and is made to be a Tekken character. But the reason why he has his 90% combos is because he's using a completely different system, uh, not only of combos, but of, you know, meters and supers and all this kind of stuff. And it's just very bad game design, actually. It's not, it's not smart. So, I feel like they just really need to get their shit together because they're ruining it for me. They're absolutely ruining Tekken 7 for me. All this bullshit. 